Hello and welcome to Chef's Choice with Citizens Gas. I'm Angela and joining me again today is Dave from Dottie's Kitchen right here in Indianapolis City Market. Dave, thank you so much for coming back thank to be with us. Thank you for having us back. All right, and I have heard that today you're going to show us how to make just a real traditional Italian family dinner. Yes, yes. Chicken Marsala, very simple. We're going to make it simple. If you just order this in a restaurant, you might pay $22 or more. Huh. Inexpensive, easy to prepare. All right, so at home I'm going to be able to make it for less than 22 bucks, right? Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, All right, yes. so tell us what we've got spread out here. We're going to start off with the chicken breast. Okay. Now I've got a four-ounce chicken breast here. If you're good and hungry, you may want to use six. You can use an eight. Okay. Depending on your appetite. Let me have the oil here, and we're going to get this started. Okay. If you would pound that out to me oh. for me about a... Uh, quarter of an inch. I sure will. Fun in the kitchen. All right, so if you've had a frustrating day at work, here's what you come home and do. <laughs> See? We're going to put a little bit of oil on the, on the pan here. How's that? Let it get warm. Well, just a couple more. Just a couple, just a couple more couple wax. More if you All right, and tell us what else we've got spread out here. After we uh, saute the ki chicken nice and tender. How's that? We're going to add the ingredients. We've got uh, chopped onion today. If you can start chopping onion for sure. me. All right, and so because we're cooking over natural gas, our pan is already nice and hot, right? You know, if, if I was doing this with electric, we'd be standing here waiting for who knows how long for that pan to get oh, warm. you can't have that, Dave. But we've already, we're cooking with natural gas today. What a wonderful way to go. It's ready to go. Pan's ready to go. We've, All right, I'm going to chop the onion. So how long should that chicken take? We got, uh, I want this to get nice and pink on the inside and all cooked all the way through three, four minutes on each side. If you've got them pounded out nice and thin? Yes. Okay, and how, how much heat do you have going under there? We're gonna cook over a medium heat. I've got it uh, high right now to get the uh, skillet warm. Okay. But we're gonna go to a medium heat here shortly. And I noticed you've got some brown sugar set out here. Is yes. that a typical ingredient for chicken marsala? When we get ready to add the ingredients, the brown sugar is optional. Ooh. If, you, if you like it sweet, I love the brown sugar. Uh, well, I love it sweet, so I say we stick it in there today. Sure. Any, any day, you're liable to have most anything. So I am going to practice that trick out. <laughs> we're done with the uh, with chicken here. We're just going to spread that out here on the rice. All right, now we're ready to make the sauce, right? Now we're ready to make the sauce. Right, Let's well, add, uh, add our water. We've already measured out here. All right, so now you're just kind of getting all the good chickeny parts off the skillet. Throw in the mushrooms. Oh, yes. What I, do you want next? I don't want to clean the skillet twice. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Why bother? <laughs> We're going to get a couple onions uh, in here and saute this. When it's tender and it's done, then uh, the last ingredient uh, will be the uh, brown sugar and our wine. Okay, and you'll just let that kind of cook off real quick and it's ready to go. As soon as this is tender, we Don't can... Don't forget, uh, you can download Dave's recipe for chicken marsala anytime. Just go to recroom.com or citizensgas.com. <laughs> you can see how we've kind of caramelized here. Yeah, you can. Okay, let's use a little bit of wine here. Here you go. So about how much are you gonna pour in there? About a fourth of a cup. Okay, so just a splash kind of. And you said the alcohol will cook off, so what's left then, just kind of that really intense flavor? Mm-hmm. Oh, and yeah. I see you're holding it over the flame. Now why are you doing, what's that for? Just to kind of boil it down just, real quick? Just getting her to cook up, get the, uh, I was just getting a little bit of the, the wine down here, make sure we get good and hot. I don't want to get you drunk if you sample this. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. No, we're not going to do that. It's not that kind of show on Chef's Choice. Ready to put some of this beautiful sauce over our chicken here. And I am going to grab a fork and taste it. While I do, Dave, how long has um, Dottie's Kitchen been in City Market? Well, Dottie's Kitchen's been in the City Market for uh, eight hmm. years. We've taken a couple name changes, but we're the, still the same restaurant. We still serve the same uh, natural ingredients. Great food. Great. Uh, I hope that you think that way. But I do that chicken. To be dish. here for eight years, we've done something right. <laughs> yeah, that's right. And that chicken is delicious. Well, thank so you. I encourage everybody to swing on by the city market, check out Dottie's Kitchen, or again, download Dave's recipe to make it at home. Dave, thank you so much for stopping by again to show us how to make this beautiful chicken marsala dish. Thank you for having us. Oh, it was our pleasure. I encourage everybody to head down to the city market, check out Dottie's Kitchen, or don't forget, you can download Dave's recipe online anytime. Also remember, Chef's Choice with Citizens Gas is available for viewing anytime at Comcast Video On Demand, RecRoom.com, or CitizensGas.com. Thank you so much for joining us today. I'm Angela. I'll see you next time on Chef's Choice with Citizens Gas.